Today, similar to the... What? <laughs> <laughs> There's a Catholic law that states we must financially support the church. But how much? You don't know? Well, I'm Jose. Let's talk about tithing. Let's begin with where the term tithing comes from. In the days of Moses and Joshua, there were 12 tribes of Israel. These tribes were huge families that originated from the 12 sons of Jacob, whose name was later changed to Israel. One of these tribes, the tribe of Levi, became priests that served the other 11 tribes by offering sacrifices and worship to the Lord. This was a full-time job. So the other 11 tribes would financially support the tribe of Levi, also known as the Levitical priests, with 10% of their crops, 10% of their livestock, and 10% of whatever else they had. And that's the biblical root of tithing. Today, similar to the Levitical priesthood, we have people who dedicate themselves to the work of the church, and this is a full-time job. So it only makes sense that we are to financially support the church to carry out this ongoing mission to bring God to the world and the world to God. So when we tithe, do we give 10%? Not necessarily. The church states that no one is obliged to give what they cannot. So there is no dollar amount that you must give. However, St. Paul makes it clear to the Corinthians that whoever gives little will be given little and whoever gives much will be given much. God loves a cheerful giver. That is why Jesus loves the woman who gives two small coins. That's all she had. She doesn't limit herself to 10%. She gives 100%. So what would I recommend to you, as you may have already started your first job or are very close to it? I would advise you to start at 10%, 5% to your local parish, and 5% to other Catholic organizations that you love. Many adults didn't build this habit when they were young. And now they are not willing to sacrifice the lifestyle they are used to living off their full wage. But if you start now, you will build your lifestyle around God. And this will be much easier as you make more and more money. And always remember, tithing isn't about giving God 10% of your money. Tithing is all about God allowing you to keep 90% of all of his blessings. We are the main benefactors of tithing. And now you know about tithing. <laughs> don't don't put that on the bloopers. <laughs>